Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have an old favorite. So here we're at the Pixel Cheap booth taking a look at some of their new display technologies. So here you can see one of their older displays, and here they have some of their newer 7-inch. So here's one of the 7-inch, here's a 10. Uh, the middle display is 1280 by 800, and here we have 1024 by 600. Um, it's quite difficult to see on camera, but the new displays, these two over here, have actually got um, increased color saturation and uh, the white points just look a little bit nicer. Now I placed my phone with a, this is the pad phone, with a QHD display over here around the edges. Now I just thought I would we'll wait for the sun to come back around and see how that goes. Yeah, quite difficult to read my phone. But anyways, just uh, I just thought I would check, check in and kind of give you guys a little glimpse of what Pixel Chi is still doing. Right now they're kind of currently focusing on uh, the more in industrial market and the military um, segments of the, of the market. But I'm sure you uh, caught Mary Lou's um, blog post a couple of maybe months or weeks ago that talked about uh, an iPad, you know, an iPad 3 competitive display that would run at a significantly lower wattage. Um, Currently the rumors around the next generation iPad display are, are that they're going to knock it down by maybe one, one watt or half a watt. What Pixel Chi is talking about would drop it down by, what, 50, 70? I don't know. I can't remember the numbers exactly. 80%? 80%. So we're looking at an 80% difference in uh, retina quality display um, power consumption. So that's significantly different from what the rumors around the new iPad display are looking at. So even though Pixel Chi may have dropped out of the consumer focus just for now. I wouldn't write them off just yet and we'll keep an eye on what they're doing because well, you know me, I love being mobile. I love uh, having my technology usable in full sunlight because I can't be cooped up in an office. I'm Nicole Scott from Network News taking a look at what's new with Pixel Chi.